What's up world, I'm Mr. Vaca, and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you all about the Google Chrome extension called Kami. This is a PDF editor. It will actually be able to edit any document and turn it into an interactive learning experience. Once you open up google.com and make sure that you're logged in the top right corner, I want you to type in Chrome extensions. And when you search that, the very first thing that pops up is extensions Chrome web store you will be taken to this site and you're gonna search the store for Kami, K-A-M-I. Hit enter and this is it, the Kami extension PDF and document annotation. So if you click on that, you will have right here the option to install this extension. Now I have already installed this extension so I don't have that option. Instead I have remove from Chrome. Okay, so now, how do I use Kami? What am I gonna do with it? Well, if you want to, you can just scroll down here and you can check about all the different things that Kami has. You can click read more, but I'm gonna show you live what Kami does. Now that I have the Kami extension installed on Google Chrome, I'm gonna go to my Google Drive and search for a PDF that I wanna edit. I'm gonna click my PDF, open it up, and now, once I see the open with, I can click that box up top and I have annotate with Kami. So if I click on that, now that Kami symbol appears and it's gonna ask me to log in or sign up. Now you're gonna log in with your Google credentials. So we're gonna click with Google. You are going to choose your Mahanasin account and it's going to automatically link up your Kami with your Google account and here we are. We're now utilizing Kami in Google Drive. So I'm gonna click right here and click markup. I now have the ability to do a text highlighter, a box highlighter, I could do strike through, I could underline, and I could even make a comment, make a text box. So let's say for example, I wanna put a text box and I want it to be a 12 point font and I wanna put it right there. I can now type in whatever I want. I can expand the box. I can change the font up here. I have all the different tools at my disposal. And you'll also see some locked features like equation. You'll see text to speech, dictionary. That is for the paid version. But right now we're using the free version to utilize their services to make your life easier. Now that I've finished marking up my document, I wanna make sure that it's saved back in the Google Drive that I was using, the same exact place that I pulled this document from. So when I'm all done, you're gonna to go to the top right and you have the save icon. When you click on that, you are then gonna have the ability to put it right into your Google Drive. Now this is the exact folder and location that it's at. So if I click on it, it's going to open up a new tab and show that I have the new file right there, the updated file right there. So if you have any questions, you need any more explanations, let me know in an email or down in the comments section below. And if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, notification bell, because it helps out the channel a ton. Thanks for everything. Don't forget to work hard, play hard, and I'll catch you next time.